Hello everybody, my name is Avnephilim and welcome to Portal. This is, well, if you're any kind of gamer, you know what this is. Is It's basically puzzles with portals. Well, I've never played this game before in my life and I've wanted to do it. So now I do it, let's play on it. Also, I'm getting my webcam recording a different way than what I normally do. I'm getting it through my action and I found out that if, as long as I export, uh, the video before I import it into the oh my editing software, the webcam footage will stay and I can just edit it as normal with webcam. So let's do a new game, starting with the test chamber. Again, I've never played Portal 4. I've already changed my controls to what I need them to be. Hello. Welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from Please. 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 Never play the game, but I know all about you. What to do here? Excellent. Please proceed to the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For okay. instance, the Aperture Science Weighted Storage Cube. Alright. So that's disorienting. Please place the Weighted Storage Cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. Okay, you're just gonna randomly activate the portals. When do I actually get the portal gun? Beg pardon, open. Thank you. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. You are sarcastic. Just like I heard you were. Excellent. Can I get the, grab the gun? I won't let my, set down my own portals. Mess up my recording because it's knows the time. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi rare cases, emancipate tender fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. Okay, so I just had to press you. Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. 
With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... Should I? Yes, I know that going through those fields will get rid of any portals I've set down. Let's again, let me shoot down a uh, yellow portal. Come on. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Portal up there, woman. I get it. never mind. Never mind. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Yeah, yeah, I know the theory that Chell is blessed. Yeah, I, I haven't quite fully learned to think of portals just yet. Loading. Welcome to test chamber four. You're doing quite well. Required test protocol. We will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Oh, thank you. Does that mean I'm going to get to fire off a yellow portal or am I stuck just using blue for the entire freaking game? to think with portals now. I'm getting there. I'm, I'm getting there. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Uh-huh. Yeah. I know you're crazy. I know all about you. You're the you're the antagonist. Like seriously, I you don't even have to play the game to know all about it. It's talked about so much. While safety is one of many enrichment center goals, the Aperture Science High Energy Pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused unbelievable. You, subject name here, must be the pride of subject Hong Kong here. Yeah, that was kind of easy to figure out. Was there some, when do I get to start letting down my own yellow portals? I want to let them in. I should point out, with the way uh, I'm getting my webcam with this, I'm not going to be able to move it around during editing. Or Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Whatever. 
Good. Now use the Aperture Science Unstationary Scaffold to reach the Chamber Lock. my character like that that's weird like i'm tr i actually try to have no idea how this could be even a program i mean this why don't we see more stuff like this 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 game is amazing like this is one of those things where like i really regret having not been a PC gamer? More? Please up? know that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. I do. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do I'm thinking. get what needs to be done. I figured it out. I didn't realize that it was bouncing back and forth. There we go. Actually, that was as much me not being... I knew what I had to do. I knew I had to get it over there. I just didn't... I didn't notice that. Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Right. Yeah, if I had noticed that it was, or if it had registered that it was bouncing back and forth and not just dissipating, 
then I would have gotten that much sooner. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere yeah. of extreme pessimism. That was easy. A child could have figured that one out. So once again, when do I get to fire my own yellow portal? Hello again. To reiterate, previously, <laughs> momentum. Okay. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Hit. Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Yeah, I get it. It doesn't affect momentum. Oh, I kind of did that upside down. Cool. Did a trick shot with my own body. Always doing trick shots. I keep worrying when it does that. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. for that. Was almost 
was bad. But now... The device has been modified so that it can now manufacture two linked portals at once. As part of an optional test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject phone call, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I can make my own set of portals. I can make both yellow and blue portals. Where is it? Where's that orange? Is that supposed to be orange? An orange. Let's see that. I'll just say bold. I'll say orange. Blue and orange. Bye bye. That would actually happen. <laughs> Gladys is sound happy. But I'm actually going to. I'm actually going to cut it here for now. Check to make sure the video is okay and I'm not just wasting time trying to record this. And if if you're seeing this, then me it worked fine, then there's gonna be more. So for now, thank you guys so much for watching as always. I will see you in the next episode. Later.